What is up guys, Anthony here, and um, <clears throat> today I'm going to be doing a game review slash quick little update on the channel, um, or basically what I do, I guess, I don't know. So the game we're, re we're going to be reviewing today is called Minute Quest. You, uh, if you search it on the app store, it's going to be in Jap- the name's going to be in Japanese, but the translated, I guess you could say, it means a Minute Quest, so let's start playing. Uh, the game's very, very simple, actually. It's kind of like a rinse and repeat game. So let me just let this low for a second. Here, let me bring the volume down, so... Okay, basically, what you do in this game... What you do in this game is, um... You start out in the beginning, and then as... You start out with nothing. You don't have... You're not level 109 with freaking flame bard sword with a... Shogun armor and Nagaruda for a pet. You just start out with nothing. And you just kill enemies. And once you kill enemies, you get XP. As you can see there, it says 200 sex 233 XP per, pin per minute. And I have 18 gold per minute. Um, when you kill enemies, you get gold and you get XP. When you get XP, you, you'll get enough to level up. And once you get gold, you'll have enough to buy items such as armor and... Weapons, like right here, this is an armor shop. Um, th this is just a game, you don't, this has no plot or storyline to it. It's just a nice little addicting game you can play in your free time or you got n nothing else to, to play. Um, I don't know why the soundtrack's not playing right now, but it does have nice 8 bit graphics, like 8 bit -y kind of feel to it. And th that's pretty much all there is to it. There's bosses. I don't. Ca I can't really. Um. I have these little houses right here. Um, you can go in there and you can pay them to heal you. Uh. See, so yeah, I leveled up again. That's. Anyways, um. There's not really much to it, and really. So. Okay. The update about the new series, um, ironically, I always say, oh, well, I'll get to it, but finding a game that works, that works on an iPod 4 and will, I, and will run on iOS cleanly and lag-free is actually very hard. I can't use my iPad on the weekdays, so that's, that's, I can't even do that, do, do that on the weekdays either. So, I've been looking into games. I always thought about doing my sm a Smash Bros. 3DS thing. What that means, I'd have to record it with my iPod since I don't have a capture card. Which would be completely stupid. But, I've been looking into it. Don't think that I'm just sitting here blackly, like saying, oh, can't find anything. I have a lot of consoles. Like, literally, I have, like, a, I have a bunch of old stuff. I don't have a lot of new stuff. I have stuff like a Super Nintendo, like, and a Nintendo 64, and a Wii, and a GameCube, and all that stuff. I have a lot of games I can record and show you guys, just that I don't have the equipment for it. Anyways, um, hang in there, guys. I'm trying my best right now. Don't really have much to work with, or whatever, I guess. Okay, so, see you guys, I guess. Wait for it. See you guys then.